I only found out shortly before everybody else did, and yes, it was a big shock. I mean, only months ago, I was on my way to a parole hearing when I was told that she would never be let out until 2024. I do believe she is a threat. She is a woman who had six children and yet could co-conspire to kidnap a 14-year-old girl and not only sit next to her while being raped, but encourage her husband to continue to rape me. So do I believe that she is dangerous? Yes, but not just to me. I believe that she is a danger and a threat to any vulnerable person in our community, which is why our community should be worried. Wanda Barzi saw me as her slave. She called me her, her handmaiden, and she never hesitated to let her displeasure with me be known. So there were times when, yes, absolutely she was manipulated by Mitchell, but she in her own right abused me just as much as he did. I think for me, having my own children has really helped me realize what my own mother went through and how difficult that was for her. And it's also taught me that being a mother doesn't just necessarily mean pushing, physically pushing a child out of your body. It means loving someone so much that you do anything for them in the world and being there for, there for them every second of every day, no matter what. And this woman, Wanda Barzi, despite having physically birthed six children, she was no mother. And I think that's what makes it all the worse to me. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.